All right, thank you guys. The NC Dinos take on the KT Wiz, 5.30 a.m. Eastern start time. The Dinos are the $2.25 favorite. Totals 10.5 juice to the over. The Wiz are plus 170. And if you like the Wiz to cover, they're plus a buck 10, catching the run and a half. And following Monday's sports wagering action, I'm 5-2 and two with a push in my last eight Dog of the Day tier package plays on patreon.com slash brockpage. And that's a website where I sell really great sports pick subscriptions beginning at just $1.99 through the end of the month. Now that extra daily pick uh, is another one of those packages that I sell as I'm also 17 in 6 in my last 23 picks in that membership as well. Good for 74% during that stretch. I also have a bunch of different uh, other great membership tiers and packages that you can subscribe to. And if you just want to check out the website, maybe browse a little bit, check out my current record. Link for that site is in the description section below. And once again, that's patreon.com slash Brock Page. Now, the Wiz lost 4-3 to three this morning to the Dinos. They've also dropped two out of their last three and averaged just two runs per contest in those three outings. The Wiz have been victorious in just 18 out of 42 games thus far in the season. And that's good for a win percentage of just 429. They're also currently in 8th place in the 10-team KBO. They're taking on a Dinos team who's won their last two straight themselves, along with winning three out of their last four. Now, the first place Dinos are currently 17 games over 500 and three games ahead of the second place Doosan Bears in the standings. And when it comes to the total in this one, three out of the Dinos' last four stayed under the total of 10.5 runs. Meanwhile, the Wiz on the other side saw their last three straight stay under that total themselves. Five out of their last six also stayed under that number. Give me the NC Dinos minus one and a half getting the job done on the run line in the under ten and a half in that contest. And before we go ahead and move on, just want to take another quick time out and welcome you to the program. Got some lines and personalines out for tomorrow. Well, tomorrow's... KBO action. So that would be Wednesday's KBO baseball action. But before we dive into some more of that, I just have to quickly remind you once again that after Monday's sports wagering action, I'm five and two with a push in my last eight dog of the day premium plays on patreon.com slash rock page. And of course, that's a website where I sell really great sports picks subscriptions beginning at just $1.99 through the end of the month. There's also a bunch of different great membership tiers and packages that you can subscribe to. A lot of great variety, lots, uh, you know, a lot of different stuff going on. Uh, and uh, we'll bill you the day you sign up and then the first of every month following that. Now, one of those packages on that site is called the Extra Daily Pick Tier Membership. It's only $2.99 through the end of the month. And I'm currently hitting at 17 and 6 and my last 23 picks in that membership as well. Good for 74% during that span. I strongly recommend you at least consider using the website for sports picks. They're my personal plays, games that I personally have action on. And once again, that's patreon.com slash Brock Page. And with that said, let's go ahead and move on. I'm talking about the Kai Womb Heroes versus the LG Twins. 5.30 a.m. Eastern first pitch. The Twins are minus 150, totals 9.5 flat. The Heroes are plus 115 to win it. And if you like the Heroes to keep it close, they're minus 182 catching the one and a half. Now the Heroes beat 